Today we're gonna try Ego Pop-Tarts, which I didn't know were a thing until today, but apparently they came out in January, so I'm a little late on this one, sorry, but yeah, they're Kellogg's Ego Maple Flavor Frosted Pop-Tarts. Sounds very interesting to me, and you know, when I was a kid, I used to love popping Egos into the toaster and just eating them. I didn't even use syrup sometimes, I would just eat them with butter or by themselves, or get the pre-mixed ones with like chocolate chips in them and stuff like that. Used to love them, don't really buy them that much now, but I'm interested in this. I'm not really a Pop-Tart guy these days much either, but again, when I was a kid, I used to really love Pop-Tarts. Specifically, the s'mores ones were one of my favorites, and um, strawberry, but here we go. We're going to try these Frosted Maple ones. I'm going to put them in the toaster. I'm not going to just eat them out of the box like Savage. I'm going to toast them and let you know what they taste like toasted, because they're Eggo. I can't not have them hot, so let me go pop them in the toaster, and then I'll come back and tell you what I think. Here's what our Ego Pop-Tarts look like out of the microwave. Identical pretty much, maybe a little browner. The smell is strong. It really smells like a maple syrup Ego. And I'm very interested. I'm going to crack one right in half. Try to show you what's in there. Um, very thin amount, but there you go. It's supposed to be frosted maple flavoring. I'm not sure what the yellow is supposed to be. Is that supposed to be like syrup? I don't really know why it's this pattern necessarily, but let's give it a taste. All right, kind of a disappointment here, but not bad. Um, the real problem is that these Pop-Tarts do not taste like Eggo. It's remarkable how much they smell like an Eggo with maple syrup on them. They smell just like an Eggo waffle. It's insane. My house smells like Eggo waffles now because it's a tiny place and the kitchen's you know, right there. But. Uh, they do not taste like an Eggo really at all. They have the maple flavor, like maple syrup flavor, but the Eggo part is just not there. When you eat the crust outside of the uh, filling part, it just tastes like generic Pop-Tart, you know, flavor, like every other Pop-Tart when you eat only the crust. It doesn't have an Eggo flavor at all. So a little bit disappointing on that front. I don't think they're bad by any means. I, I'll, I like them, I'll eat them, but really they, they might as well just be called maple Pop-Tarts because the Eggo part just does not exist. Um, they're just maple and they are pleasant. They're pleasant. They're, the maple is not actually too overwhelming. It's actually a little lighter and it is a pleasant experience and I do like them but I feel like I've been misled by the marketing on this one because I really just wanted something that I could pop in there and have the Eggo flavor from my childhood but that's this is not that. This is just basically a maple Pop-Tart at the end of the day so with all that said, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. Um, Value-wise, it's the same as other Pop-Tarts, so that's not really into consideration. I, I was leaning between a 3 and a 4 because I do think the flavor is good, but I'm not specifically liking them. I wouldn't buy them again, um, and I do feel a little let, let down by the premise. So I think a 3 is a fair way to go. You can try them if you want, but just know they don't taste like Eggo, so probably just avoid them and get the uh, Pop-Tart flavors you already like. Try s'mores if you haven't. Those are really good, but... Yeah, that's the Ego Pop-Tarts. I don't know if they're a limited time thing or if they're sticking around. Like I said, they came out in January. I just saw them now, so they might just be a permanent thing. Who knows? But either way, they're mad. So with that, I'll see you next time.